We have to get to this breaking news. Dramatic images coming in. A passenger ship capsized with hundreds on board. It was hit by strong winds, heavy rain from a cyclone. They are racing to get survivors out right now. The captain of the ship has been arrested, and ABC's Terry Moran has all the latest. Incredible scenes on the Yangtze River. Rescuers pulling survivors from the water, exhausted after their terrifying ordeal. And this, look at them tapping on the hull of the overturned ferry. They can still hear people yelling for help inside. So far, 14 survivors, some pulled from the water, some escaping themselves, including the captain, but hundreds are still missing. It happened just about 9.30 p.m. Monday in China. That's almost 18 hours ago now. A pleasure cruise, mostly senior citizens. Then torrential rains and fierce winds sank the boat quickly in 50 feet of water. Now hundreds of divers from the Chinese Navy are on the site. Officials say the boat has drifted two miles in the strong currents and there are still air pockets inside. Desperate relatives are furious. I am angry, this man says. We have no idea whether our relatives are dead or alive. Chinese Prime Minister Li Keqiang rushed to the scene, a whole nation riveted by this disaster. All this grimly reminiscent of last year's ferry disaster in South Korea. More than 300 killed many young students when that boat capsized. The captain there has been sentenced to life in prison for murder. Now in China, many are expecting the worst. The captain of that ferry has been arrested. He's reportedly telling investigators his boat was hit by a sudden cyclone and sank in minutes. Robin? So tragic.